what is going on guys it is your boy shady mike gaming and wow uh, it took us a while to get here but welcome to the release of the version one or we're going to call this the 0.1 beta edition of my nba 2k21 slider set can you believe that we're saying that wow that is crazy so without further ado first and foremost i am repping just a little bit, you know what I mean? Uh, this video is going to be, that intro is going to be super awkward if I just decide to put gameplay and not my face, but I guess I kind of have to now, right? But wow, when you think about the, stat, the state that 2K launched 2K21 in, you think of how long it took them two weeks to get the PC version of the game, a patch. Um, depending on when you're watching this, Friday they actually dropped an update that greatly improved the gameplay for the game. I'm, I'm just... Wow, to really get here, this this year was tough. This has been one of the hardest and most frustrating years to make sliders for this game. They have it even remotely playable. Um, it was hard to work on 2K21 when I felt like I had a better game uh, in 2K20 sitting right here on my desktop. But we are here, and I want to talk a little bit about the process and you know everything that went into this set. I want to talk a little bit about the channel. Um, you know, and what to look for in the future, the next gen version of 2K. Um, this is just going to be me talking with you guys. And uh, so let's get right into it. All right, guys. So first and foremost, let's talk about the set a little bit. And I don't really know how else to say it. I, I didn't want to do it. And, and I didn't want to do it. And, and it's crazy because... The only reason I did it was because people were expecting it and it was crazy because I wasn't enjoying the game and it's hard to put so much time into trying to fix the game when sometimes the devs themselves don't really seem to care about what you're playing or rather at least the version that you're playing. Now we all know that the next gen version is coming within a month and well I'm, I don't have a next gen system. I'm not getting a next gen system so I'm not going to have that version of the game. So. I'm stuck with this edition. I know there's other guys on PC that are stuck with this edition and I wanted to put something out and I'm going to continue to put stuff out for the for the guys like me um, who are here. And uh, so that kind of brings me to the next topic. Um, it's really weird because, you know, you know, we're doing the modding Mondays and things of that nature, but it's just like when the next gen version comes out are people really going to want to see what we're doing when the current gen version of the game i don't know so kind of puts me in limbo but at the same time anytime i can do something to help this community and you know everything this community has meant to, to me for years i used to dream of wanting to work for 2k and make basketball video games and i don't do that i probably will never because of how critical i am i'll probably never actually be hired by 2k uh but you know what i mean just the fact that i get to work with you know this game and try to make it better and help other people who want to enjoy video game basketball because we're all passionate about it we're all that's why we're here just the fact that i get to do that um and i got you know we're pushing 6k subscribers we started the year with three we we done doubled our subscriber count and i hope that you know within the the coming you know year and stuff like that we can continue to grow um it's it's been awesome and you know that that is for me you know a lot of people come in the, the comments and say hey thanks for the sliders and for me is more so i want to you know thank you guys for supporting um the 2k modding society our modding discord which i always have linked to my videos such a great group of guys you know making this whole process you know really enjoyable so um for me i don't know what's next for the channel i'm going to continue trying to improve the game i'm going to continue trying to cover mods um, there may be a mixture of 2K20 and 2K21. Obviously, I'll indicate before videos which one we're doing. But just in case people really aren't checking for, you know, the last gen version of 2K, I want to continue to grow the channel. I want to continue to, you know, branch out and play other games. I, I might start streaming on Twitch. I might start streaming here. I've dabbled in a little bit of both. And some of you guys have come over and said what's up in the middle of the streams. And trust me, that means the world to me, too. Uh, but there's so many different games that I want to play. Genshin Impact, Persona 5 Royale, uh, the Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Um, I'm running through Ghost of Tsushima right now, but um, you know, I, I, I felt like I, I felt obligated to do the sliders first because that's what we do 
uh, you know that's what we do as sim gamers that's why most of you are here but um oh and obviously call of duty too i'm like literally you know a really good call of duty player and i would love to start getting recognized on some of that because i do think i'm one of the better players you know around the community so uh but i really wanted to you know iron out this this slider set and, and give you guys something that and, and i wouldn't have dropped it if i didn't feel you know good about it um, so that's really important to say too this is not just a beta that was thrown together this took hours i've got let me see i, I want to see right now i'm gonna pull it up i have 300 hours flat of 2k21 played i do this i live this i'm passionate about it um, it's just sometimes I also want to do other stuff. So, you know, hopefully, you know, people, you know, who are just here for 2K definitely understand that when, you know, they start to see different stuff on the channel or maybe that'll just be on Twitch. I haven't decided yet. With the release of this slider set, I'm going to keep it short, guys. I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, I'm working on the sliders and it doesn't seem like it's worth it. But when I see these comments and these likes and things of that nature, people that, you know, really vibe with me the same exact way and love sim basketball and, you know, want to play the, you know, the game in a way that represents NBA basketball is greatly appreciated. So um, if, you, if you guys don't know, I've said it a hundred times now, I've in the past couple of weeks, I've had some health issues, you know, things of that nature. And I've been in the process of relocating from Atlanta to New Jersey. So I'm here in the new office setup. I hope it looks nice in the background. I got all my figures and stuff like that and posters. Um, so I'm going to be making content on the channel, guys. Uh, I'm going to keep mixing it up. I'm going to hopefully, you know, bring some new stuff to the channel and we'll see if any of it sticks. But guys, I'm going to keep it short. Let it roll there. Let me know in the comments. I mean, let's let's answer some questions, guys. Like, how do you feel about the whole thing with, you know, the next gen version of the game? Are you someone that bought the current gen version of the game? Do you regret buying the current version of the game? Do you have confidence in 2K to make the next gen version of the game something worth playing? Um, should I try and bust my behind and get a PlayStation 5 when I can't really afford it to just to play the next gen version of the game? I don't know. These are all interesting questions. Find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Now, it would be crazy if I ended the video like that. But nonetheless, guys, I want to say thank you so much um, to all my subscribers, to everyone in the 2K Mining Society as well. Take it easy. Enjoy the sliders. Peace. Threes.